No, I could use yellow. yellow. It, it makes everything ten times better. Nice. I just can't remember like which part is what. Okay, let's go so off. Oh, yeah. So uh, this project uh, is a collaboration between uh, industrial design and their transportation design, uh, kind of like concentration and communication design. We'll be able to like, walk around. And we're only showing our best. For the class overall, like just collaboration between ID and graphic. <laughs> Um, that was huge. It's like from here up, done. Those guys are also military, but they're from here. And the reason why we did that together was because we're trying to answer uh, a bigger question than just what's your next car going to look like, right? With the evolution of, of autonomy and the shared economy in cars, now it's going to be very important not only to consider the physicality of the car exterior and interior, but also the experience that you have in it. The experience here at UC was really great for me. Um, it gave me a lot of possibilities where I could focus on. Um, not a lot of programs have this. They're more focused on styling and talking about design language. But here in VR, it was really about what does the user feel. So this was a really great opportunity to do like a collaborative project looking at kind of the future of autonomous interiors and you know how, how a company like FCA affects that kind of a future autonomy and what different cars could look like and what people are going to be doing in those cars. And I think boiled down that's what this project really was about for each different kind of group that was uh, representing a different segment within FCA. Autonomy and connectivity are shaping the group. And we've been involved and engaged, FCA, Chrysler has been involved with, with DAP uh, probably well over 35 years. UC's strength is its design thinking, which is very applicable to such a revolutionary time. The colleges are kind of the, the beginning and the, and the forefront of this, and, and it's just, it just kind of is reiterated again uh, today. I thought it was great. They were all super cool. Um, all the feedback was good, and it, it is nice to have like kind of a reality check, like coming from the outside world in the industry, like, yeah, that looks good, but like that would never sell, or like, yeah, sounds great, but is that actually practical? Well, that was one of the key pieces for us to kind of go in and, and try to get a good sense from the students as to what they anticipated uh, the ramifications to the brands being. I would really recommend this program to anyone, to all students, because the specific point here of using VR and to think about transportation design from a user experience way was really unique for me. Never underestimate the power of going down and interacting with the students. I really feel amazed uh, by the passion and dedication that students uh, showed in their projects, in their commitment. Um, they learned a lot, not, not only about the skill sets, not only about the problem, but also about it working together. So we got some really good, good concepts and good ideas, uh, and, and they went in kind of, you know, full guns a blazing as to, hey, they were unencumbered by, I guess, a bunch of the other paradigms that we have uh, as, as, as industry. And, and they went in and, and, and gave us some really good, kind of good insights and good foresights.